Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So I'm going to review this perfume called Blush, so stay tuned. Alright, so this is called Blush by Kenneth Cole. And I'm going to spray it on my hand and I'm going to see what it smells like. I smell, I smell like apples or something. Hmm. Jasmine, okay. This Floriental Gourmand scent is a flush of pink peony and bold sugared raspberry with contrasting white musk that lingers at the base, invoking the rush of a first kiss or the revealing glow from an unexpected compliment. Each spritz takes you on a new adventure. Okay guys, mm, I wouldn't say me like, all right, so first of all, you guys know I don't like floral scents, but this is not bad. I, I don't know, I'm getting more like a sweeter vibe out of this, more than like, I don't know, like a, a floral scent. But I like it, it's not bad. Yeah, it smells really, really sweet. Like I'm more so smelling like, um, more like the jasmine and that raspberry but I like it me I would wear this more like on a um I wouldn't wear this on date night I don't know I would wear this every day because I really like the scent it's not too strong it's not overbearing it's soft no it's not soft I wouldn't say it's soft it's like in between yes yeah, in between but I like it a lot so this has sugared raspberry orange jasmine peony and white musk I like it though it's it's I don't know it's not too strong or anything but it's like it's kind of like out there at the same time but not it's just not offensive to me which is good this kind of reminds me like a spring kind of scent though like I mean if I had to pick a season I don't know it's very sweet I just I don't know I like it a lot it's, it's really sweet it's kind of calming too like it's like I don't know it just makes me feel good yeah, it's really, I don't know, it just, it's, I don't know. Yeah, I like it. But like I said, I would wear this on an everyday occasion just because I like it so much. But, um, it's, oh, it is kind of flirty. Yeah. I don't know, it smells, it just smells really sweet. Like, I really like it a lot. It's not, to me, this is not giving off like a floral scent. I don't know, it just smells more on the gourmand side than like a floriental kind of scent to me even though it says it's both but um to me it's more on the the gourmand side than anything like i said i would wear it every day and hmm, yeah I, yeah this is and it's very easy going it's like i said it's not offensive to the nose and yeah i just really like it a lot okay so this perfume is 78 dollars for the 3.4 ounce and i guess because it's the holiday it's 50% off with the BF50 50 code. So you'll put that code in and you'll, you know, probably be like $37, which is, that's a reasonable price for this. Um, now, would I go and get the bigger size? I think I would. Yeah, this, this perfume is very sexy to me. I just really like it a lot. Yep, I like it. All right, guys, so we're going to get into the stars. And for the stars, I would say, I would give it a four. Yeah, I'm not going to, I mean, it's not like a wow for me, but I do like it. And like I said, I would wear it every day just because it's more on that sweeter side. So I would give it a four, in my opinion. All right, guys. So if you like this review, leave a comment down below. Let me know if you guys have this exact perfume, how you like it, how you feel about it, if you think it's a floral scent or more on the gourmand side, even though it says it's both, which I think is more on the gourmand side. But like I said, leave a comment down below, like this video, subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos.